हरि ओम दीर्घायुष्मान भव स्त्रीभ्य दीर्घ सुमंगली भव सर्व्याधिवारण प्राप्तिरस्तु सर्व ऐश्वर्य अभिवृद्धिर्भवत सर्वंगला तथास्तु हैपी राम नवमी दिन सुमंगली रियम वधूरी मगुम समेत पश्यता सौभा आज्ञ अस्ई धत्वा यातास्त विपरेतन इमागुम तम इंद्रम मीडस्सुपुत्रु शुभगा आम कुरो दशा सै पुत्राण देहि पति एकादशम कृति सुमंगली सुमंगली इव इस मंत्र इज वाट द्रौपदी पांचाली वॉज मैरीड इन दर्मिणी विवाह विथ चाटिंग दिस मंत्र शी वॉज मैरीड टू द पंच पांडवा दैट इज वाई हर ताली स्टूड स्ट्रांग इवन आफ्टर द वॉर शी वॉज नॉट वीड आउट दिस अ वेरी पवर्फुल मंत्र फॉर स्त्री टूडे इज रामनवमी डे सो ई थॉट ई विल चैट नो ई शेल कंटिन्यू इन इंग्लिश कंपेरेटिव रिलीजन हिंदूजम वर्सस् क्रिस्टानिटी पार्ट नंबर सिक्सटी so i am uh, just countering this politician who said who in a youtube i was watching he said that abrahamic religions are scientific and hinduism is not at all scientific because bruce because he told in uh, the church burnt bruce alive because bruce told that earth is not the center of the solar system which is factually true earth is not the center of the solar system but the church did not accept it so the church burnt him so there is some signs in <laughs> in christianity or other abrahamic religions but in, in hinduism we do not have he was a central minister also now i am countering my dear sir you just see genesis if you take genesis the first day god created light let there be light okay there was no light okay then they say god divided the light from the darkness oh, still i am accepting because 96% of the universe is dark and only 4% you have the light universe okay still i am accepting and the second day how the god creates life uh, light and day that is he divides the ferment of the heaven the heaven and the sky uh, the, uh, the the day and the night so he divides the light into two <laughs> and divides the light from the darkness and from the light well where is science i do not know and then he the stars come on the fourth day stars emit light see you should know when the earth was formed scientists say that it came from a nothing lorentz cross is opinion that the sort of vedas say but there was a infinitely small dot big bang was there first 3 seconds the entire creation is over now for the first 380000 light years it was totally dark because of gas there was no light at all and then the scientists sent how to measure it how to measure the age of that period scientists sent what is known as radio waves because radio waves can penetrate through the tough gas and then it measured and then it said first 380000 light years it was totally dark gas so it was formed the earth was formed the universe was formed the first 3 seconds and then the light started emanating okay light comes from the heat generated by the stars stars are nothing but suns our sun is also a star is a medium sized star now how does the day and night create as per science the day and night is created as per science only through the rotation of the earth you feel the day or i feel the day i feel the night because we are inside this earth suppose if you go uh, outside the universe like in international space station there is no day and night there <laughs> because the earth rotating and that portion of the earth uh, seeing the sun you get the light so you get the day the other back portion okay simplifying back portion gets the night because there is no sun rays hitting upon the earth this mother earth that's why because the earth spins rotates in its own axis you get the day and you get the night for 12 hours if we measure it there is no time outside our earth there is a time but that's a time is different it is not hours and seconds and minutes it's all light years it's all light years so it's very i do not know how the bible uh, came through that and interestingly in what the vedas in bhusukta it tells that also i will say and then if you go then the god says to adam and eve he tells in um, uh, chapter 2 and uh, the man was formed from the dust of the ground and then from his rib okay <laughs> that's also childish only for me but it is uh, all right and then the, there was a tree and the god says on the tree that is verse 17 in chapter 2 in genesis but of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil you shall not eat of it 
for in the day that you eat thereof you shall surely die what is meant by death death of the body or death of the soul what does god mean does not god understand that the body is not permanent if you say if this if he tells adam and eve you shall die death of the soul god doesn't seem to understand the bible god doesn't seem to understand the subtleness of the body's death and the subtleness of the soul's death okay you shall die now the tree of knowledge now if you come to the tree of knowledge he says it is both good and evil so now i'm questioning the bible god why should i have why should i do not have the knowledge of good what is wrong in me having the knowledge of good what is wrong i should have the knowledge of good and then you have created a tree with evil so you have also created evil what does it mean that how did the evil come in the garden you explain where is the explanation in bible i was searching how was the tree created he created all the trees and plants before man he created everything so all those things are superior to man because they were created first okay god why did you create a tree of evil also that means if you create an evil you also become part of an evil therefore you are also evil you know what our mandukya rishi says martyatam amrutam vrajet once the immortal knows that it is a mortal or creates a mortal the immortal becomes mortal <laughs> naturally an immortal is a state where it is immortal always true bliss and true good it cannot even think of an evil <laughs> forget creating an evil where is your explanation and you say bible is very scientific but einstein himself admits bible is childish and superstitious most of the things said in bible is not true please google and see i was not living in ancient time but still what he have said i am quoting from the google accepted by all so if you say that you do not you should not go to the tree and eat the fruit because it is a tree of knowledge both good and evil sir i should have the knowledge chapter 5 verse 16 in bhagavad gita says bhagavan says beautifully you see the science in hinduism jnanenathu jnanena tu tu means but or something like that jnanena by jnana jnanena tu tat agnyanam that agnyanam that uh, ignorance yesham of whose nashatim atmanah nashatim is second vibhakti nadim nadi nadim like that ekavachanam nashatim atmanah the atmanah of the atmana atmanah from the atmana you can have panchami and shashti also fifth and the sixth also atmana ha atma atmano atma like that it will come the, the vibhakti will come okay from that atma the nashati what is getting destroyed agnana ignorance how jnanena only by jnana tesham tath jnanam adityavath like aditya prakashayati tat param tatah param after that so once the ignorance is destroyed by the knowledge from that atma tesham dos that jnanam adityavat like a suryan adityavat means like just like a suryan prakashayati is made to shine the destruction of the ignorance by the knowledge of that atma of that atma nashati which is destroyed which destroys the knowledge by the knowledge the by the knowledge the ignorance is destroyed and then that atmanas those atmanah prakashayati adityavat tatah param after that once the knowledge is destroyed by ignorance those atma will shine like a surya adityavat tatah param tat param after that see the knowledge is there are a lot of points those who are having the name i have already told you the name of sun that is if you do the gayatri japa the rays of the sun will enter your body it will make your body shine it will energize okay i will show you i have 
I had a small uh, this lens, hand lens. Everybody has a hand lens. Now I will show you this hand lens. This is a hand lens. Used for seeing this palm and all. Now I put a paper and on a hot sun in a sunny day. I put a paper. The paper will get shrunk and yellowish. But if I insert this lens, fifth standard physics, and lace it, lace the sun rays onto the edge of a paper, the paper will burn. Now this is not a matchbox or this is not a, any uh, what is known as a fire material, combustible. It is not a, any. It is not a combustible at all material at all. It cannot create fire. But what does it do? It laces the sun rays and uh, energizes the paper beyond a point that the paper catches fire full of energy what does it do lacing that's why if you by concentration or by japa gayatri japa if you do you are going to on the sun you are, it's a nature it's a nature sun is like aditya it's one of the devas we have to have the deva you cannot say i will not worship the deva <laughs> you you will not be nowhere because your body requires the deva your earth on which you live requires the deva now, if you don't have the knowledge of all these good and evil, then what's it? What's there to criticize the Hindus that they are worshipping sun? Even Persians worship sun. Their culture is lost through Islam. Lost. Now, see what is happening in Iran, modern Iran. With a lot of oil, they are struggling to live. Where is their religion then? Method. You see, whereas Tatas who had come to India, they were also Parsi, same like the Persian. They are Persians. But see how they are... Surviving because this worship of sun god is a must. They are one of the richest persons in the world. The energy. Therefore, why I am telling you all these things is knowledge of good and evil. Knowledge of good is essential. That's what Bhagavan says. If you want to throw away the knowledge of good, what type of god it is? That's what Richard Dawkins firmly criticizes. Firmly criticizes. You can see, He's one of the best scientists, a biologist. Therefore, the knowledge is important as told by our Vedas, as told by our Bhagavad Gita and Vedas also. Knowledge is important. You cannot say that don't go uh, to the tree uh, because it, it, of knowledge because it is both good and evil. Don't tell. I will tell, please go to the tree. You will know the difference. Then you repent. If you don't touch, it means you don't touch. But you have to eat the fruit of knowledge. Maybe not the evil. I will advise. I will not say don't go to the tree of knowledge at all and take because it is both good and evil. Don't take the fruit. No, that is wrong in my opinion. I will say go to the evil, go to the tree, take the fruit of knowledge, eat the fruit of knowledge. Don't touch the, uh, the other fruit which is evil. Or why did God create both evil? God cannot create evil. The evil is in your mind. The devil is in our mind, in my mind. When I become wicked by thoughts, then I become a devil. God did not create a devil. The devil is by our emotions, by our thoughts. Let noble thoughts pour from all sides. Anovadraha, Kritavoyanto Vishwataha. Rigveda, book 1, verse number 89. Please see. Buddha says, You are made up of your thoughts only. If our thoughts are evil, we are evil. So, if God has created evil, then he becomes evil. And. Uh, where is the science when you say that God created the day and night? Day and night is only applicable to this earth. That's all. Day and night is not applicable outside you shift yourself to the International Space Station or any place, any point on earth. Therefore, what I am saying, Bible to say is scientific, I do not accept completely. I do not uh, go anywhere near the acceptance when somebody says that Bible is and the Abrahamic religions are scientific. If they come to an argument with me, I will, I will totally argue with them. No problem. I can argue with them totally. There are lots of verses in suktas, Bhu Sukta Mandal, if you see, Ayanga, Ashwinaha, Prativim, Mataram, Punaha, like that it says, that is the cow, the, uh, the, the, the moon. Like a like a like a calf uh, attached to the cow goes around this pitaram to prayan suvaha they will say bhu suktam it goes around the father the father is a son so the moon attached to its mother cow 
the mother earth goes around the poetic way of telling a uh, mother as a cow or mahalakshmi and all it's a poetic way so it goes around that that means even if you take the bhu suktam and read it properly bhu bhumi suktam the moon is attached to the earth just like the calf to the cow and pitaram to prayantsu they also go around the father pitaram dvijaya vibhakti ekavachana father is a son here so there is always like mahavishnu is chakradhari spinning see the earth every, the chakra the ayuda spinning aida no culture no civilization had for their gods come on tell me the entire universe is spinning the earth is spinning the solar system is uh, spinning and rotating around the milky way uh, gravity point the dark hole the black hole so the concept that that is wrong this is right <laughs> is uh, Uh, bible is scientific oh my god if you take bible and read there is no science at all as far as i am concerned conforming to modern science i am going to quote more of science in hinduism my book you can see a search in secret sacred hinduism by t s viswanathan it is there in e kindle amazon or google play you can get the electronic uh, format e format you can get several points i have discussed for at the base level for general understanding for all those who are not even exposed to hindu culture so these type of arguments if you bring and tell us that hinduism does not have signs whereas abrahamic religions what signs you will only you will only not understand that uh, uh, the, that signs of those texts there is no signs at all modern signs as a student of physics as a student of as a man who loves signs i would perfectly say i am prepared for any argument with anybody i will quote from laws of motion or whatever it is einstein's laws to what is available in various suktas in upanishads and there are suktas and there are see in hinduism you have the purusha suktam the stri suktam the bhu suktam the ayuhur suktam you have a lot of suktams sukta these are there some may be poetic but some are very really scientific and i will quote from all those upanishad the vedas the texts where they appreciate in a poetic way so more of it i shall uh, discuss in the ensuing uh, session till such time bhuyat tavat shubha mangalam dhanya